everyone, this is CLS on one and my family just picked up a 2017 Nissan Armada Platinum. And I'm going to give you a quick look at it today and show you some of the cool features. It's got 390 horsepower, 20 inch black aluminum rims, it's got black exterior with a black interior, built in running boards, and just the right amount of chrome, not too much, but enough to give it some accent. It's got the LED lights in the front and in the back, plus fog lights and the built-in ski rack up on the top there. Let's go ahead and take a look at the interior now. All right, here's a look at the interior. It's got a little bit of that wood grain mixed in. It gives it a nice little accent for the interior. Here's a look at the entertainment system. It's got a really cool backup camera system. I'm going to show you that here in just a minute. And it's got the Bose stereo system, so it sounds really good. It's got a pretty good sized center console here with lots of storage. And then here's the back seats. It's got the captain seats for the, the middle row of seats. And the middle row of seats actually has a pretty good sized center console also back here. And it's got the headrest monitors on both the driver and the passenger seat. And I'll be turning those on in just a minute too to show you those. And of course it's got the sunroof built in. Here's a look at the third row of seating. Uh, the headrests are down right now so it looks a little funny. And it's got pretty good leg room on that third row. Let's go ahead and fire it up here and I'm going to show you some of the electronics on here. This is an all-wheel drive vehicle, but it does have the option to switch to 4 high and 4 low, plus tow mode and snow mode. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and put it in reverse and show you the backup camera system. Now this is a really unique system, it's really cool because it's got a lot of different cameras. So you got your main camera there on the left, which is going to be right off the back. Then you got this aerial looking view. And what this is, is just a 3D image of the top of the vehicle with four different camera views. Two side cameras and a front and rear camera. And that gives you the illusion that it's an aerial view. And also as you're turning, those lines turn with you to help guide you. Then you can also switch camera views. You can make it towards just the rear camera and the side camera, or just the rear camera only. Then when you're in drive mode, you have the front camera view. And you can change that view also, where you got the aerial view, plus the front view, or the front view with the side view. Then here's a look at the camera locations. Here's the rear camera. It's located just below the big chrome strip here. And then the side camera is actually located just below the mirror right here. And the same thing on the passenger side. And then the front camera is located right underneath the Nissan emblem right here. All right, let's go ahead and check out the DVD system. Uh, we're going to put in We Bought a Zoo, not my favorite movie, but we're just testing it out here. So it's telling me the video will resume when I apply the parking brake and it's in park. So I'm already in park, so I'm going to go ahead and put the parking brake on, and now the video will start up. So they do sell gadgets out there that will bypass that parking brake feature to where you can watch it when you're driving, but it's meant for safety. But on the rear monitors, you can watch the video playback at any time. And you can adjust the angle on those headrest monitors also. And the vehicle also comes supplied with two sets of wireless headphones. Then there's also a couple sets of video inputs. There's one located here on the bottom of the center console of the front, and then also inside the center console. And here's a quick demo of the navigation. Please say call, followed by a phone book name, or say a category like navigation. You can push the... Navigation. Navigation. Please say destination home. Address. Places. Places. Please say a number from the displayed list. Say. One. One. Please say a number from the displayed list. Five. Calculating a route to. Five. Starting the route guidance to your destination. Continue on the current route. Then there's quite a few options in the navigation too. For instance, you can change the view. You can change it to a 3D style view, or the bird's eye view, or the split screen view. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. If you want to hear more from me, please like and subscribe. And if you want to check out more of my videos, be sure to click any of these links.